Hey Goji, I thought you might be interested in these light painting ones. You can watch this little video. Now you can relive your favourite moments from the wizarding world with the light painting wands. Use the wand's ultra bright LED tip to recreate dramatic wand duels, cast spells and draw your Patronus charms in mid-air. Create and share your light paintings using the free smartphone app. Each wand is an exact replica of the original movie prop, cast in high-grade resin and hand-painted. Share and compare with friends and family. Wizarding World Light Painting Wands from Wow Stuff. If you want to know what the wands are like, Gia, there they go. They just have an awful LED stuck right on the end. And you download that one to your phone. They're not bad, they're smineys. And you join us back home, guys. Paula was here. <laughs> Hi, babies. Um, what you saw before was um, we just quickly visited uh, Smith's Toy Store because uh, I had to go and get some dog food and Halfords. And usually all these things are in the big, uh, like on, on big retail parks, they're all the same shops. So we popped in and um, those Harry Potter ones were, I think we, were, we hadn't seen them before, had we? I haven't seen them before. I haven't seen them before. Um, it said that they were essentially the ones that you can buy, but with a, a light up LED stuck on the end rather cr crudely. Um, there was only two kinds that I could see there, which was Harry Potter's and Hermione's. Um, yeah, it was okay, I suppose. It's, uh, once you, 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 you join it together with the app, it was it was something new, I suppose, but no, nah, not for me. But um, you might like them, Jay. I mean, it's, it's something new. I hadn't seen them before. Um, but yeah. But onto the wand I made. Um, let's take a quick look, shall we? I'll I'll turn the camera around so you can see it a bit better. Here's the top of the the, the pummel end of the handle. As you can see that there's the uh, hole I've drilled for the for the eye which goes in here, and there it is. Is that that eye is going to go inside there like that. Now, as I said before, I'd carved this so it looked like a, like dragon scales. So you can see there, it's all lines and bumps and things. And I've coloured it with a darker um, stain. And in the back here, can you see that I have a star? Now that star there is going to glow in the dark as well. Um, with a very quite a powerful it's actually the same glow in the dark paint that i used on the wand that, that glowed up along the shaft of the wand it's the mm -hmm. same it's the same glow in the dark paint um so i'll charge that up and i'll quickly show you it again tomorrow once it's fully charged um so yeah there we go that's essentially how it's how it looks um now all these details hey these raised details here are gonna absolutely pop once i put the varnish on um and i can't put that on until tomorrow um, because the varnish I was going to use has actually dried up. I don't know how it's done that, but it has. So there we go. I did. I've got a few of these um, glass eyes. There's the there's a red one. Uh, the, the the other one that I was toying with putting in was this one here. Um, I I I quite like the the detail on this one. Um. But because it's a dragon's eye, you think dragons, fire, red. I want to go for that one. It might be an ice dragon. It might be an ice dragon. It might be, yeah. Exactly. I don't. Who knows? Um, I tell you what. Whoever watches this, and you look in the comments, um, which one do you want me to go for to put into this one? Do you want me to put the red fire type eye, or the the ice? blue type eye so let's have a quick look again so there's the fire red one there and here is the blue ice type one you tell me in the comments which one you think i should fit in the wand and i shall put that one in for the for the customer How's that? So there we go. So we did a little bit of um, exploring the deer in Newcastle. Um, 
we did a bit of toy browsing as well and we found some new Harry Potter products in Smith Toy Stores and I've carved a wand. So there we go. Productive. Productive. Um, so I'm off and we will see you tomorrow. Bye, guys. <laughs>